God has made that same Jesus both Lord and Christ. Ladies and gentlemen, a love relationship with the Lord Jesus is the only thing that will give you victory over sin. Holiness is a love relationship with the Lord Jesus. The reason I sin now is because I forget or don't understand what I have in Christ. Once I see him as he really is, there will be nothing in the universe left to tempt me. I'll realize that God has proved the devil a liar and that he has not kept the best back from me. He that spared not his own son, but delivered him up for us all, how shall he not with him also freely give us all things? You can't tempt the queen with paste jewels. She'd say, maybe you want to take a little trip over to the, the tower bridge. I've got diamonds as big as cricket balls. You, 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 you got nothing to tempt me with. The fact of the matter is, Christian, that the more we know of Christ, the less this world will attract us. And when we see him as he really is, and let, let me tell you, a lot has happened since gentle Jesus, meek and mild, rode on a donkey into the city of Jerusalem. God has made that same Jesus both Lord and Christ. And the last book of the Bible is called The Unveiling of Jesus Christ. You haven't seen him yet. You have no idea how magnificent and glorious and beautiful, attractive, gentle, gracious, loving, wise he really is. He is the epitome of every attribute, of every characteristic that you find attractive. He is the ultimate. He is the best lover. He is the best listener. He is the best help in time of need. He's the best everything. God thinks so. That's why he's given him the name above every name and given him the highest place. And he's your bridegroom. And when we see him as he is, there'll be nothing left to tempt us then.